Hello, my dear friend, I'm David de Cortese, and this is my website www.david-cortese.com. In this video, I will show you how to program in C language, and exactly we will do together step by step this program. So, uh, the sum of n numbers. This program calculates the sum of n numbers. You can find this PDF on my website inside the section uh, Software Engineering. You must click here and you will find uh, this PDF in the subsection T Programming. So, the program sum of n numbers so let's do together step by step this program using the code blocks that is uh, an open source cross platform id so let's start create a new project console application t project title sum dash of dash n dash numbers ok we click uh, next compiler new gcc compiler ok finish now we can start to code so we click on main point c we zoom the text Ctrl plus 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 Ok, so we have uh, hashtag include uh, standard input output library hashtag include sdlib.h so we can delete this line return 0 uh, we write exit access ok so we have uh, as integer variable we have n and i that we initialize to 0 and float a and s that we initialize to 0 so print f number of numbers is equal to semicolon at the end can f between parentheses between uh, quotation marks to send uh, d because it is an integer ampersand n the ampersand because it is a scalar and it gives the address of the variable uh, to the function so while uh, e is less than n print f so number of numbers now we we write number number so we can write here backslash n for a uh, space so number percent d is equal to comma i plus one so we have uh, the number uh, the index of the number that we are adding that we are writing so scan f between parentheses, between quotation marks, the percent f because it is a float and ampersand because it is a scalar semicolon s is equal to s plus a i plus plus semicolon then we write print f between quotation marks backslash n sum is equal to percent f backslash n comma s ok 
So we have two integers, n and i, and i is zero. We have two float numbers, a and s, and s is zero. So on the screen, we write number of numbers and uh, we must write a number that uh, is read like uh, an integer that is n while e while i while i is less than n we write uh, printf number is percent d is uh, an integer because it is the index plus one because uh, it starts uh, from zero can f uh, so it reads the number that we write and percent f because it is a float it calculates the sum uh, that is the sum plus a i plus plus so this is the end of the while and then printf sum is, is equal to percent f so it is a float that is the sum as exit success so we can uh, click here build and run so build and run number of numbers three number one one point zero number two 1.1 number 3 3.2 so the sum is 5.3 3.2 plus 1 is 4.2 plus 1.1 is 5.3 okay so we can go in release we click here build and run and we try uh, minus one and in fact it is uh, an error because uh, uh, it gives that the sum 0, 0.0 because we cannot give uh, a number of numbers that is the minus one okay so we retry number of numbers uh, uh, 3, 4, 4, minus 1.2, minus 2.2, 0, 0. So it is minus 4, minus 3.4. So minus 1.2 plus minus 2. 0.2 it is minus 3.4 okay it works so we have created a, a simple program in the C programming language that sums the that sum n numbers so on my website you can find a lot of information about software engineering web development math tutoring physics chemistry and so on you can find a lot of games written in javascript you can find music uh, you can use also my chat so if you want to write me something if you want to ask me something you can use my chat uh, it is uh, written in PHP so one day probably I will have the time to explain this uh, project hello you can write you can write here okay So, I want to remember as the last thing that uh, if you are interested in this project, you can join this community, be a friend, your donation is important, 
help me update this website and join this community. So thank you for watching, see you next time, bye bye!